close your eyes. Take a couple of good long, deep in and out breaths, and notice how the breathing feels. Stay with the breath each time it comes in, each time it goes out, all the way in, all the way out. And if other thoughts that come in your mind, just let them go. You stay with the breath. This gives you some continuity here in the present moment. It's good to be in the present moment because lots of important things are happening here, and you want to see them clearly. The intentions with which we shape our lives, in terms of what we do or say and think, they arise here in the present. And if you don't watch them, if you're not clear about them, then you can end up doing all sorts of things that you wish you hadn't done. Many times you know better, and yet you go ahead and do the things that you should have known better not to do. Why is that? Because you weren't watching your intentions carefully. That's one good reason to stay here. Now, how can you stay here unless it feels comfortable? So try to make the breath comfortable, too. If you feel like you need some extra energy, breathe in nice and deep. Fill up your lungs and see how that feels. If you feel more energized and that's what you need, that's good. If you feel tense, try to breathe in a way that's more relaxing. Otherwise, try to find a way to stay here with a sense of ease and clarity. It's like being a hunter. You don't know when the rabbit is going to come past, but you just stay very, very still and very, very alert. And then you start seeing things that you didn't see before. And here we are hunting down our greed, aversion, and delusion, because those are the things that cause us to act in ways that we wish we hadn't. And so you have to be ready for them when they come. That's why the stillness is not a lazy stillness or a drifting off kind of stillness. It has to be alert, right here, very present with the present moment. So try to find that right balance between alertness and stillness. So when unskillful intentions come, you can recognize them for what they are and shoot them down. In other words, realize that they're not what you want to go with anyhow. As for skillful intentions, you try to encourage them. But you can do that only if you're staying right here in the present moment. If you're wandering in the past or wandering in the future, you don't really know what's going on right here, right now. Everything is on automatic pilot. So take some time to stay right here, at ease with the breath. Wherever you feel the sensation of the breathing in the body, allow it to be comfortable. Just right. Not too long, not too short, not too heavy, not too light. What feels just right for your body right now. And let that become the place where you stay normally, because then you're much more in charge. And the decisions you make, the choices you make, are much more likely to be ones that you'll be happy you made.